The Organic Painter by Carney Griffith. Griffiths. <laughs> learn to paint with tea coffee embroidery flame and more so you get an introduction uh, part one preparing your materials part two projects um, so you do get samples of the works that um, is done um, and un under each part tells you what's um, in it um, it's not a long type of book um, there's uh, some images to show what's um, being talked about. So, um, like with tea, um, using it as a medium, loose leaf, and then bags, choosing your color, um, liquor, um, calligraphy inks, for menace, uh, making your own ink, other pigments, um, Like what to use for a certain color, like smoke foliage kind of thing. Um, painting with objects like um, rubber stamps, palettes, pens, that type of thing. Um, you do get some information that it's not totally in depth. Um, you do get some information about applying and working with the materials, dividing your page, bleeding. Um, adding details. Um, in the projects section, you get some images used as examples. Um, does give you a list of materials for the project and like and is talking about it. Um, it's not a step by step book. It's just here's it's basically here's what was used for the project and how he went from start to finish, like, how we kind of gotten to the end, kind of, um, end result. Um, you get a glimpse of, of the artwork and how the pieces, and the pieces, you get a glimpse of the pieces he has done, so it's, I was expecting more, kind of like, a, more of a step-by-step -step kind of thing of, how to paint with um these different things but you're not getting that type of book it's just him kind of talking about here's how you would use certain things in your artwork and here's some projects that i did with them <laughs> um that's the basis of what I got out of it. So if you're looking a step by step um, book of using more natural um, materials to paint with, um, you're not going to get a whole that or a whole lot of that out of this book. It's a nice little um, introduction to it because you're getting like an idea of like how one per one painter uses it so you're like okay yeah um <laughs> so um but yeah uh again it's fair a very nice good look at um using those more natural materials but again you're not getting a step-by-step -step project type of book but yeah, The Organic Painter, happy readings.